I think I think it's coming along well, and uh, you know, feel comfortable with it, being able to visualize it. I thought I think the uh, you know the receivers are, are adjusting well, know what they're doing, um, playing fast, offense lines doing a good job. So um, obviously got a couple new a uh, couple new pieces, a couple new people in there, but I think. Um, especially on the offense line group. I think they're adjusting well, communicating well, and obviously every day is important. You know, get a little better, get a little bit more comfortable every day um, with the offense, with the calls, with the adjustments you can make. And, but I think uh, we're doing some good things, uh, but still, you know, we got, we, got, uh, we got a lot of work to do. You know, obviously he just ran maybe four routes or so, four or five routes, but, uh, you know, looks good coming out of his breaks. And, um, you know, uh, you, you know, from from what I see, it looks uh, he looks sharp and, and ready to go. Eli, a big difference from a year ago, just in general around here. What do you feel in terms of this team and the chemistry and the and the overall attitude? Yeah, I mean, I think the attitude's good. I think uh, you know, there, there's definitely some excitement uh, amongst the players, and uh, which is good. And I think uh, you know, the guys are competing out in practice every day. Um, I feel like everybody's got something to prove, and so I think uh, you know guys are studying hard and going out there and competing. There's obviously going to be mistakes and and things every day, but you know guys are learning from it and not repeating the same ones. So um, you know I think it's been a good start. We just got to keep we got to keep it going and and keep finding ways to improve every day. Nick said last year was a humbling experience. I mean, when you look back on last year, you sit there and go, it could have been better or more better or what. Well, we just got, you know, lost some tough games early on that kind of hit the injury bug, and, and it was just, uh, you know, it was tough after that. Um, so, you know, hey, uh, obviously last year was tough, and, and yeah, this, this game can definitely humble you. Um, nothing's guaranteed. Just, you know, from the year before doesn't doesn't mean anything to the next year, and that's uh, going from, you know, uh, you can go from good to bad, bad to good very quickly, and just a matter of, of uh, you know, the team buying in, everybody playing, everybody, you know, uh, doing their job and, and finding ways to win, you know, tight football games. And, uh, you know, that's kind of the difference between a good year and a bad year a lot of times. Eli, you've been around a bunch of different offensive lines. I imagine you would say the best ones you've played with had a certain chemistry together, um, you know, strange chemistry maybe, but chemistry together. Do you have any sense of this group so far and how they are in that regard? Yeah, you know, it seems like a great group. They get along well, um, you know, eat lunch a lot. They're, you know, good character guys. Uh, it's important to them. Uh, yeah, yet they can, you know, you know, it seems like they can have fun and enjoy being around each other, enjoy, uh, you know, just the work that goes into it and, and take great pride in, in their craft and communicating. And, and so I think that's a, you know, that's a, that's a good thing. I like, I like the group and now it's just a matter of everybody kind of coming together and that, you know, that five just being on the same page uh, as I'm, you know, making calls and making sure uh, you know, we're all seeing things the same way, and so they can play fast and, and do their assignments. Did you sense that some of that camaraderie was not there last year on the line? No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that. Um, you know, but um, uh, no, I wouldn't necessarily say that. But I, I like this group, and, and uh, you know, I think it, it can be a special group. Obviously, made a lot. The team made a lot of improvements on this offense in the offseason. Just curious, how do you feel? How much better can this unit be than last year? And is this the most weapons that you can remember having that you just both I think um, yeah, it's just, I mean, it, it can be a special year. Every year can be a special year. It's just a matter of, of, uh, of how guys play on Sunday. Um, you know how they how they deal. There's always going to be ups and downs throughout the season. You know, uh, it's just you know, can can guys uh, keep it about the team and, and keep it together and stay committed for uh, you know 16 weeks, 17 weeks, and then going into the playoffs. So uh, I think it's a good uh, it's a good crew of guys, and and it's now it's just. Hey, how how hard can we work? How committed can we be? And, and putting this all together and, and finding ways to win together. Eli, like, considering how vehemently you defended yourself out here last year, were you satisfied or disappointed or any reaction to the settlement with that lawsuit? Uh, just glad it's over. Hey, coach just talked about clean slates for a lot of guys. Do you kind of feel like that that last year was wiped out in your mind? Well, I think I think when you get you know you have a new coaching staff, um, you know you get a, you get a clean slate, and, and obviously you got to you got to prove to them that you're ready, that you're you know can can get the job done, and you can get prepared. And so, um, you know, I'm trying to get better every day, trying to pick their pick their brain, pick their mind, and make sure I'm doing um, you know what what they what they want me to do, what they expect for me to do. And so, um, you know, I think that's that's kind of what you try to do every year. So uh, I think it's just a matter of can you yeah can you go out there and produce and and make plays on, on Sunday. Did you enjoy the spring or the OTAs or anything? I mean, you've been in 15 years in the league. How do you? Uh, yeah, I, I enjoy the spring. I think it's a great time to, 
uh, you know, get the, get the guys together, start working on your crafts, uh, especially when you have a new offense. Uh, I think it's very very important to um, you know get in here and learn it. And you know, it's exciting for me to be in the meeting room with the you know with the uh, you know coaching staff and kind of get to learn football. And you know, there's there's uh, you know lots of different ways to. Uh, to run an offense, to uh, uh, run plays and different reads, similar plays, but you know, read it differently. So just you know, learning from them, buying into it, and uh, you know, kind of look forward to the challenge of going out there and, and perfecting it and, and and being successful in it. You know, a couple of your former teammates said the Giants have wasted your prime. I'm curious if you agree with that. No, I, I don't. I don't agree with that. I appreciate you know, you know, obviously those are uh, close friends of mine and and. Uh, and I won a couple championships with them, so I appreciate their, their loyalty and support, but uh, I, I wouldn't uh, necessarily uh, agree with the comment. Eli, what do you think of Barkley so far? You know, I think Saquon's done a good job. I, I've been impressed with him, you know, just learning the offense. Um, you know, he's come in quickly, has a good feel for things, and, and uh, obviously physically uh, he looks the part. Uh, I'm excited to see him with pads on and see him in the open field and, and see what he can do, but, you know, he's done a good job in the um, – you know, in the, in the spring and stuff, you kind of see more in the passing game, and, and you get to kind of uh, work on some of those things. He's been impressive in that part, and uh, but I'm, I know once you, you know, get the pads on and get some live contact, uh, he'll he'll be impressive running the ball as well. Have you, have you gotten to know him and, and given him extra advice? I mean, uh, coming in as a high-profile guy. Yeah, I mean, I've got to got to talk with him uh, these last few weeks, and and uh, you know, I've had breakfast with him a few times and lunch, and. Uh, you know, sat with them a little bit. So, uh, you know, I think, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not to be the guy to kind of uh, throw a bunch of advice at them, but if, if something comes up, I always kind of, uh, you know, let, you know, try to try to offer, you know, some things I've learned over over my time here. What have you learned your impressions been of the defense? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, I think uh, I think the defense is, has done, uh, you know, they got some good stuff. Uh, obviously, I think it's great work for us going against the. Uh, you know, kind of a blitz-heavy uh, style defense where you know we're getting, uh, making a lot of calls. Offense lines will be tested every day. I'm going to be tested and just trying to um, you know read read the you know the coverages and the disguises and everything. So uh, I think it's I think it's you know we're getting great work and defenses you know they're making some plays. We've got talented guys on the other side and and so every day is you know competitive. Try to kind of win win the day. How would you describe a, a James Betcher defense? You know, well, you know, going against them, I think it's uh, you know using an aggressive style. You know, they, they like to try to, I think, uh, try to pressure the quarterback and, and get you know bring try to bring five guys and and uh, you know disrupt the timing of the quarterback so he doesn't sit in the pocket and um, and so I think uh, you know they're, they're always I think uh, tough to prepare for, um, you know, just because they're they're very multiple and so uh, yeah, I think it's it's great work for us to you know get that work and. And uh, instead of having a team that's pretty simple and playing, you know, one or two coverages now, hey, well, you know, once we start playing, uh, playing other teams, we should be prepared for a lot of things. Well, obviously, the last month, the last season was a difficult one for you. I'm curious if there's a point in this off season where you were able to sit down and, and think about it and process it, and, and what did you, you know, what conclusions did you come or what recollections did you have? Well, yeah, I mean, you just try, you try to learn from from every season uh, and see if there, you know, could have been something different. Did you, you know, do everything possible? I feel like I always, always train hard, always prepare hard to go into a season. Um, you know, sometimes it just doesn't, it doesn't uh, uh, work out for you. So I think it's still, you know, do do the things I've been doing uh, that you know put me in positions to be successful. Uh, just continue to work smart and and be dedicated to doing doing your craft and try to you know go out there and. Uh, and just you know, uh, make things different this year. Did, dra did draft night kind of show that that was in the past for the organization too? That kind of the faith in you they showed. Well, yeah, you know, when when uh, obviously yeah, on draft and drafting a running back, uh, I think you know showed that they they still think I can perform at a high level and uh, and lead this team and and uh, be a successful quarterback in this league. Eli, you do have two young quarterbacks following you around now. Uh, your thoughts on, on what you've seen from both of those guys this spring? Yeah, you know, I think I think all the quarterbacks, um, you know, with Kyle and Alex and Davis have, have uh, you know, they've worked extremely hard. They've been in the meeting room a bunch, learning the offense. Uh, uh, I think they've performed well on practice, made made some plays. We're, you know, we're all you know we're all, all learning this together. Uh, so you know, um, in, in there with all those guys watching the film, um, you know, just kind of talking to each other. All all of us have been in. Different styles of offenses and, and you know different things from colleges, uh, other other places. So uh, you know, trying to all, all you know learning this uh, with each other. If they you know if I have any 
um, you know, things I've learned over the years, try to try to help them out in any way. Just enjoy, you know, talking football and, and uh, you know, and, you know, helping, you know, everybody helping each other out.